Okay, so I'm going to share a few more miracles um, that I shared on TikTok this week. I'm trying to remember which ones it was. So it was, um, let's see. Okay, so in December, before I went to see my kids, um, I was in church and I was just worshiping. I just hold my hands out like this. And I felt um, like the healing anointing in this hand. And so I feel like he wants to heal someone. And I'm just kind of looking around like, who does he, who needs a miracle here? And um, there was a lady just a couple chairs away from me. I didn't know who she was, but I don't know. I just, um, we were singing. And so I just kind of like talked to her really quietly. Like, do you need a miracle in your body? She's like, yeah, I do. I was like, you do? Okay. Then I was, I told her like, I feel like the healing anointing. So I'm going to pray for you. And she said, okay. So I prayed for her. And then... Um, after the service was all over, I, we kind of introduced ourselves to each other. And then, um, I said, can you, will you be able to tell if you got a miracle, um, or not? And she said, yeah, I did. And yeah, so, um, so that was fun. And she said, thank you, like probably five times while we talked to each other for like two minutes. And then, um, let's see. And then last Wednesday night. I was at church, um, and my friend Mary, um, she's an older lady, super awesome lady though, and um, uh, she um, was telling me that her sciatica hurt, and she had these health problems, and so um, I was praying for her, and I just kind of lightly put my hand on her back, just the fingertips, and um, hi! I'm recording a vlog for my YouTube, so <laughs> um, that's okay. Uh, so I put my fingertips on her back like this and was praying for her. And then um, I could feel like the power going into her and stuff. And then, and it was hot. And so afterwards I was like, so did you feel, did you feel the heat from my hand? And she's like, yeah, I felt heat coming out of your fingertips she was like I've never felt that before and I was like yeah it happens to me a lot lately and um, everyone gets healed so she was like awesome and then um, we were talking and she was like I feel it like it's strengthening like I feel support in there she said and then we were just so like the presence of God was so strong we were just we just kept praying like we just kept talking to the Lord and like this and um and I was just holding my hands like this I could feel the power going even though I wasn't touching her I could feel it going into her because she also had heart problems too um so I want to hear back from that but uh, um so then after we did that then she we were talking a little more and she's like I feel the heat like from uh from like the back of her hip all the way down to my bad knee she said and I was like, God's healing you. He's just going to keep healing you even when you go home and go to bed. <laughs> and so, yeah, <clears throat> that was awesome. And then um, let's see what's the other one I told about. Okay, so when I was down uh, to see my kids at Christmas, um, I was telling my kids about miracles that I've been seeing lately. And when Ken and I and Leslie first got there, my son and his wife first got to my daughter's house and I was telling them like these miracles and stuff. And my son was like, um, well, my back hurts. And so I was like, all right, let's pray. So I put my hand on his back where he said it was hurting and I was praying and it was really odd because like part of my hand was hot and part of my hand was cold kind of like icy hot or whatever so I was just praying for him and yeah he felt that too and um and then yeah he got healed so that was awesome because they were about to go to bed and glad he could sleep without his back hurting <laughs> and then um what was the other one I told about this week oh yeah uh so the this last fall um, I was sitting in church with uh, my um, a couple of my Mexican friends, and um, it was like the last song, like at the end, you know. So we were worshiping, and like I was like this, and then I felt like it. <laughs> I know this is it's weird to try to talk about what you feel like, 
in the spirit, but I felt like um, two balls of oil in my hands and I felt like it was like healing oil. So I said to my friend Deanna that was sitting next to me, uh, Mama Deanna, for those who know my friends, the Deannas, um, I said, do you uh, need a miracle in your body? And she was like, yeah. She's like, I, I injured my shoulder and I can't work. I think she had told me that before, actually. And then when I felt that, I was like, okay, I'm going to pray for her. That she had injured her shoulder and she couldn't work. And it was kind of an old injury, but then she was working and she injured it and she couldn't work at all. And so, um, so yeah, then I put my hands on her and um, prayed for her and just prayed until it felt like all the power went into her and it was like done. And she kind of felt it at the same time. I could tell because she was like, amen. <laughs> And so then I knew and then I was like, how is it? And she's like, it's good. And then I think I might have prayed for her again later because she wasn't going to go back to work until after um, her after she was done uh, doing all the stuff for her daughter's wedding. So that was like a month or two later. And I think I might have prayed for her again at some point in there. So then as soon as her daughter's wedding was over, then she went back to work. So that was awesome. Is that all of them? I think so. <laughs> all right. And I also got to pray for a lady um, at church on Sunday. And it was an interpersonal thing that she wanted prayer for. I didn't know her, but like the pastor had the, the guy that was speaking said, you, you should, um, you know, offer to pray for each other or ask each other to pray for you or whatever, which I love. I loved that, that he would say that. And, um, uh, so we all went up and then when we went back to our seats, she had been sitting in front of me and she just asked me to pray for her. So anyways, so I prayed for her like it was an interpersonal thing that she wanted prayer for. So I don't know what happened yet. But anyways, she was like so blessed. <laughs> it's funny when we got done praying, she was like, that was so beautiful. I feel like that helped. And, um, and yeah, she was, you know. <laughs> but uh and then like she was talking to me a little bit are you on the prayer team here I'm like no but I'm here on Sunday's second service and I'm always available if you need prayer or whatever and she said you know she's like um I can't remember what she said but anyway <laughs> anyways she was so happy she gave me like this chocolate bunny that she had in her purse like she had a couple of these chocolate bunnies and she gave me one of them <laughs> so that was really cool so that was fun Anyways, so that's this week's miracle vlog, so I hope that was a blessing to you. Okay, bye.